All right, so quick tip today. Um, saw a lot of videos on YouTube saying how to repair a hole in a mattress, but not a lot on how to find them. Figured I'd do a quick one. Uh, I don't really make a lot of videos like this, so, um, but I figured this was really important to share. As you can see, I've already soaked the mattress a lot. Um, did a lot of trial and error. Um, I found the best way to find the hole was soapy water. I've seen people say uh, to set the, mat the air mattress up on the side. By the way, this is a self-inflating mattress. Um, I've seen people fill it with water and sit on it and uh, the water squirts out the hole. Uh, some people say set it on its side and um, put your ear real close to it and go back and forth over every surface of the air mattress until you find it. Uh, wet your lips and put your lips up to it and you'll feel the cold air blowing out onto your lips. Um, I've heard a lot of different tactics, but honestly, the soapy water has worked best for me. And I'll show you how it works. So the top of the mattress right here looks about the same as the bottom, except it has this like, uh, I don't know, fletchy material on it, which is okay. Um, so the one thing I would recommend doing, because you probably have something hiding in your carpet, let's say you have carpet, it's going to puncture the bottom before it's going to puncture the top. Uh, so I'd recommend trying this on the bottom before you move to the top. But my hole just so happens to be on the top, and I'll show you how I found it. I filled up a water bottle full of water, probably about 70% water, and I did two squirts of um, like hand soap, just enough to get it that, that nice soapy, you see the suds there, the nice soapy, uh, the nice soapy uh, mixture, I guess. So what I did was, and, and the first, the first thing you're going to want to check is these seams right here, okay? So um, I thought about probably the leak was sprung somewhere along the side where where, where, the, where the glue meets up, where, where it's attached. Um, but I found that a lot of holes um, that I found online that they were patching were found in this, in this crease kind of area right here. So that's where I started looking first. I started on the, on the bottom first, moved to the top, and sure enough, I found the hole. So soapy water, sprayed it long and, and you can do kind of a wide angle I do kind of a, a, a very stream um, type of type of uh, angle here and I'm really going in and I'm making sure every bit of it you want to get it nice and wet make sure every bit of the surface is covered make sure every bit is covered here get it in there and and you're gonna see a little bit of bubbles that's just the soap but when when you see the hole it's gonna be it's gonna be apparent it's gonna be very noticeable you'll know it as soon as you see it, look at that, right there, all right? It's so obvious, you, you won't miss it. It's, it's the easiest way to find any hole. You, if you're sitting on the mattress trying to push out a little bit more air, watch, I'll, I'll sit on it and show you what I mean. If you're sitting on it thinking that it's gonna make it more apparent, look, you can even hear it. Right there, okay? It's gonna squirt back at you, see that? If you're sitting on it with all the extra air pressure, it's going to squirt back at you. All right. But look at that. It's so obvious. You see a little bit of these bubbles right here. A little bit. Don't get distracted by that. Look for the big ones. You're going to see it. It's going to be very noticeable. So that's the quickest and easiest way I've found uh, to find a hole in an air mattress.